Bell rings, and in this case, it means class is in session with the self-proclaimed Master Gable. I don't think I like your tone, Cole. Few have the athletic and academic accomplishments that Chad Gable does. If that doesn't make you a master of your craft, I don't know what does. We'll see if he's truly a master of his craft in this match. Ray Wyatt is a different kind of beast, though. Sometimes literally demented, sadistic. Bray is a devious mastermind who can punish his opponents in every possible way imaginable. You don't face Wyatt without a piece of him lingering inside you forever. Axe handle from the middle rope. Oh, it could be nap time. I mean, how do you get out of this sleeper hole? What can they do? Look at this great reversal. That's one way to do it. Taking head over heels. Ah, look at this. Jarring impact. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Ah, oh, kicks right to the midsection. Opponent dropped in the corner. Mud hole stomping. You got to wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Oh, that could break it on. He thinks he has it. A kick out before the referee can get to one. Looks like it's going to take much more here. A lot of ways Gable can win this match tonight, Corey. What do you think affords him the best chance to earn the W? Cardio, cardio, cardio. Amateur wrestlers have some of the best motors of any athletes in the world. And as an Olympian, Gable's ascended to the highest form of that discipline. All he has to do is draw the match into deep waters and the win will be in reach. Finds a counter for Gable. Taking this one back to the ring now. A oh, big punch. Ouch. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. And he goes into the ring. Got to find a way to get out of this. Check your face out of that one. And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. I don't know, into the cover. He forces a break before the count of two. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. This is nothing short of disturbing. Oh, so frightening. So bizarre. So eerie. It's Welcome to get worse to sister. He's able to sidestep there. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. And that broke Bray down a bit for a change. An excellent example of the wrestling knowledge Gable possesses. He's got the answer for that one. Chad Gable goes behind, holds up his opponent. Nice German suplex. Holding on for another. And why not? Let's get a trifecta. Nice. Is it enough to overcome Bray? Kicking out next time. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Ah, look at this. Systematic attack on that arm. Uh oh, gonna try to break the leg. Ouch. Leg breaker. Ah. 
Oh, there's the old stop pulling oh. leg snap. Oh, that's going to hurt. Tear your hamstring. Tearing down the leg now. A consistent attack being mounted on Wyatt. Gable's motor on display. Looking to take this one into the deep waters. Vicious knee drop. Gable setting his sights and lining him up. Beautiful gator roll. Great way to disorient your opponent. A big kick to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Gable is stumbling to his feet. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Will this match end on a submission, on a tap out? In this Bray Wyatt gets the W. Bray Wyatt wins it. Here is your winner, Bray Wyatt. And Gable was unable to get it done. I'm sure this will only add to the demented joy of Wyatt. It's almost scarier when he's happy. Follow the buzzer.